This week on Quick Tip Tuesday, we're going to show you how to use these plug cutters. Come on this way. The purpose of a plug cutter is to cut a cylindrical piece of wood that will fill the hole that's left after you countersink a screw into some wood. Once you've pre-drilled with the countersink bit and driven your screw into the wood, it's time to chuck the corresponding plug cutter bit up into the drill press. The key to plug cutters is to cut the plug out of the same type of wood that you wish to fill the hole in. A good tip is to use a small screwdriver or awl to pry the plug out of the wood. You want to hammer the plug into the hole, making sure that the grain pattern is the same as the base wood. This will ensure that it basically disappears when you go to sand. Fire up the sander and sand away the top of the plug. You want to be sure to stop as soon as you see that the plug is flat with the surface. If you need to use a screw or fastener much bigger than you can find a countersink bit for, you can find plug cutters that correspond with Forstner bits. The process is exactly the same. Counterbore your screw, find the corresponding plug cutter bit, cut your plug, hammer it into the hole, and sand it flat.